The latest version of the Risa Revit link now includes support for Revit 2022, as well as the support for the exchange of cold form steel wall panels. Additionally, we also support the ability to export selected grids from Revit into Risa 3D. Now in this quick video, we're going to go ahead and just export this really simple model into Risa floor. In this model, we've got some wood beams, we've got some glue lamb beams, I've got some wood columns, I've also got some cold form steel framing in this little entryway and then some hot rolled steel columns. The other big thing here is we actually have our cold form steel wall panels. So if I go ahead and select one of those, we can see that they're a basic wall type, cold form steel stud, and this is a six inch wall panel. Now, if I go ahead and edit the type here, we can edit the structure. And in the editing of the structure, we can see the material here. We can also edit the thickness. This is just gonna edit the depth of cold form stud that's gonna be used um, and transferred into a uh, Risa floor. And so if I go ahead and cancel that out, now when I'm ready to export, I'm gonna go ahead and choose export to Risa. Obviously we can set our criteria here, so I'm just gonna choose Risa floor. We're gonna to choose to have walls on so we can export those cold form steel walls. Obviously we're gonna export our project grids as well. We can also choose, in this case, I'm gonna to choose to keep the sizes that I've set in this particular uh, Revit model. I'm also going to head and I'm gonna choose our Risa model file. So I'm just gonna browse for that file really quickly and choose this model file and then click OK. We'll save our file, and then the export will go ahead and start. And so we'll see this progress bar here. Just walking through the, extract, the extracting of information and all the information that's sent. Now we'll see here, we don't have any error messages, but we do see we've got our beams, columns, materials, walls, openings, all sent. And so all of those openings, both window and door openings, were included in those cold form steel wall panels. We could open a log file if we want, but in this case, I'm just gonna go ahead and click OK and Risa Floor version 15 in this case is gonna launch. Now I'm opened up. I can go ahead and see, I'm looking at my roof here. So this is my roof level and then my second floor level. And so maybe the better way to look at this would be our look at our full model. So here's our full three-dimensional model. And so here we can see we've got our wall panels. We've got our cold form steel framing on the roof on this kind of low roof canopy. We've got our hot rolled framing. We can also go ahead and check back to our second floor. And if we go ahead and select one of these wall panels, we can select to see that this wall panel is indeed a panel type cold form steel. We've got that same large opening here. And we can see those studs are six inch studs. And so that information all came over from that model in Autodesk Revit. For more information about the Risa Revit link, including the download file, as well as the release notes, please visit risa.com.